SEMA show day one. How's it going? It's going awesome, man. I, this is my first SEMA show, and we're trying to make a killer presentation, and I think we're doing it. I would have never thought this was your first SEMA show. I've been with the company 10 months, man. I changed industries 10 months ago. <laughs> so, you know, I, I put it all in. You do, just like your customers do. This paint outside the can deal, and I can't wait to speak to the guy who won the award, but I'm taking a look at some of these cans, and it's like, it's unbelievable. I'll tell you what, we uh, started this contest about five months ago. Two months into it, I'm sitting there waiting for entries to come in, thinking, I need 12 entries to have a contest. We end up with over 30 entries. And this guy who won, he set the bar up here. Unbelievable, the passion this man had. He didn't just paint outside a can, he thought outside the box. He did something that nobody else did. I mean, look at this thing. It's got its own power pack and it lights up. It's ridiculous. I actually, he wouldn't even send this to us. He hand carried it in yeah. to our offices in Pennsylvania. The minute I saw it, I decided this shelf had to get wider just in case he won. Yeah. Oh. You know what? And he did. This guy did a, th a three-way sweep. He won the grand prize. He was one of the, we had five celebrities pick cans. He was one of the celebrity picks. He also, we also did uh, fan favorites on Instagram. Oh, good idea. And he won, uh, he was one of the Instagram fan favorites. So this guy won three ways. He set the bar, he swept the competition. He's incredible. So how did you find out about the uh, paint outside the camp promotion? Um, bored one day and I needed a little inspiration. Started skimming the web and I came across Exalta's uh, website and I noticed they were running the uh, contest. And I went for it. What do you do full time? I'm a corrections officer. So I would imagine having that ability to take that stressful environment and then open up that creative side when you get home, you probably look forward to getting home, huh? Correct. Exalta is my painting with their products. That's my therapy. Yeah. Um, keeps me calm. Yeah. You know, I enjoy what I do. I have a lot of passion for what I do and I enjoy their products. Well. Uh, as I can see by looking at all the other really, really well done competitors that were a part of this promotion, you literally went outside the box, the can, however you want to describe it, where not only did you take the focus on the can, but also, I mean, the, the paint coming out of it, the holder, uh, that really was creative. How do you start? How do you start something that turns out like this? That started out as four chunks of metal in a trash can. And I picked it out of the trash can and put them together and decided I'm gonna do a pipeline. And what would be better with the pipeline than to create a industrial tropical fish tank. And from there, ideas just started flowing. And every day I just put something new to the can. When did the part about showing the paint come out of the can, was that a part of your, your thinking early on or did that come to you? Initially, it wasn't, it came to me afterwards. So how did that, how did it come to you? What was it? Um, I wanted a 3D effect and to wow everybody. So what I did was I actually made a clay mold first and structured it the way I wanted it to look coming out of the can. And I used the uh, hot hues candy concentrate and dyed the clear resin until I came up with the color to match the can. Yeah, I want to congratulate you on behalf of all the folks from Exalta and even, uh, I guess, folks in this industry for the inspiration, uh, the great work. And, you know, as uh, we talked to the Exalta guys, you know, once you're in, you're in. So now you're a part of that Exalta family, and I'm sure we'll be catching up with you at different events. And, yeah, rightfully so. What a great group of guys, you know. And product-wise, well, you know, right? Product-wise, it's got to be some of the best stuff out there. Yes, it is. I currently use uh, Chromax and Hot Hughes products. Um, pinstriping, airbrushing. You name it, I love the products. Mike Burton is definitely part of the Exalta family now. I saw all the painters who participated. You know, uh, these guys really, I mean, think about how hard they work day in and day out, and then they turn around at night and they're doing this. Sure. All right, they're in the family. Yeah. They're in there. Yeah.